Vue.js has skyrocketed in popularity. It has earned a solid reputation, not unlike myself, and a vibrant community of developers who love working with it. They say that learning Vue.js will not only boost your career prospects, but also connect you with a passionate community of like-minded developers. One thing I do know is that Vue.js is famous for its easy learning curve. Even if you're a beginner, Vue.js welcomes you with open arms. It's straightforward to set up and it has clear documentation. You start learning and then you're building interactive interfaces without breaking a sweat. It's also very flexible. What this means is that you can use it to enhance your existing projects or build new ones from scratch. If you know modular power supplies, then Vue.js is like that. And this allows you to create reusable and self-contained components. This is going to make your code clean, scalable, and easy to maintain. Speed matters a lot, and Vue.js understands that. It uses the virtual DOM, which can be a benefit or a con, depending on how you look at it. And this minimizes the number of time-consuming updates to the actual web page. This results in decently fast rendering and impressive application performance. It's not as good as some other front-end frameworks like Svelte, but it's pretty good. When you start learning Vue.js, you'll find a thriving ecosystem that offers a plethora of libraries, plugins, and tools. So for example, need a pre-built component, Vue.js has you covered. You're stuck in a problem, the community is going to be there to help. They create a supportive environment where knowledge sharing is the norm. Many frameworks have this community, for example Ruby on Rails, but I thought I should mention it. Some companies that actually use Vue.js would be like Alibaba, Xiaomi, Tencent, and Adobe.